1993 Mercedes 500E. And right now we're looking at the pressures and we're looking at the cycling of the electric fans when they come on and they're coming on somewhere around 237 PSI. Right. I gotta get it zoomed in there. There you go. Somewhere around 237. And then right here on the pressure where you see it go up, you see it's down there 24, 23, 23, 23, but then you get the high peaks 32, 31, 31, 33. That is when the clutch is cycling off. So this is the clutch cycling off. It's at idle. Then if you go back to the temperature, see it's cycling off right when it hits 39 degrees. If you look at these dips right where it hits 39, every time it hits 39, it cycles off. And if you come back to the pressure, you'll see every one of those temperature from the temperature where it was hitting 39 degrees, you can see the cycle off time. So the pressure is matching up to the temperature coming out the dash at every cutoff. So here you can see the pressure. You can see we're in pressure. We got that outlined. And then here you can see we have the temperature coming out the dash. The high temperature is 41 degrees. So somewhere around 41 degrees, that's where it kicks the compressor back on. And then you see it slowly sloping down, getting colder and colder and colder. And then it hits 39 degrees. And then it sends the signal to turn off the clutch. And then you'll see the clutch stop. You can see the clutch turning down there. There you go. You see that clutch right at the tip of my finger. That's the clutch turning around right there. And if we come over here, you can see it's almost 39 degrees. Oh, I think I just heard it. Yep. Now you see the clutch. The clutch has stopped. And it stopped at 39.3 degrees right there. And you see the pressure going back up and the clutch came back on. Doesn't like to, uh... And another thing about this one, I didn't know this is a, a fact. Did you know that this Mercedes was built by Porsche in a Porsche plant or the, the engine was? It was actually, this is a 500 engine and it was built by Porsche in a Porsche plant for this particular Mercedes 500e and the difference is you see the flares on the fenders and um, supposedly even Mercedes-Benz guys don't like working on these engines and uh, and that's why it's here in this shop because uh, that's what this owner of this business specializes in he's very very detailed about research and all the vehicles on whether they're BMWs or Mercedes that is his thing. You always want the guy who's the geek, the nerd, and the guru of your vehicle to be working on your car because he cares about your car. All right, see you guys.